hello friends welcome once again so in this video we'll be talking about parallel execution in the stages on the pipeline so so far the pipelines that we have created was having only sequential steps you see one after other now let's say we have multiple things to deploy so uh, we want to deploy something in parallel maybe like front end and back end in parallel or maybe i want to run multiple regression test cases or maybe like uh, something on chrome something on firefox and something on safari all in parallel or maybe i want to release to different environments in parallel so all of these use cases uh, require uh, you to change the pipeline in a way so that you can execute these things in parallel so let us take an example that uh, i want to update this regression test and i want to run it on multiple browsers so i want the parallel stages instead of this a sequential step that i added or just one simple logging that i have added here all right so in this regression test what i do is i simply create a parallel so let me first explain to you this uh, with a scripted way and then we'll be talking about declarative so in scripted way what you need to do is you need to put that inside steps directive all right so inside uh, steps you need to have this parallel with a round bracket and then inside that you need to give the stage name chrome and then colon and then uh, inside that uh, in uh, curly braces you can put that logging message all right so after that uh, the next stage you need to put here uh, like firefox one but you need to have a comma in between similarly you can give the third one uh, let's say safari one all right so all of these are separated by comma and you see this parallel uh, keyword uh, after that we have used a round bracket because this is scripted syntax all right so rest rest of the things are declarative syntax but inside that we are using scripted one we'll see uh, a, a declarative one also after this so we have uh, pushed our changes into this uh, uh, jenkins file 4 we can see here i have configured that already now we need to create a new pipeline and in that we will be using this uh, jenkins file 4 all right so i go back to the dashboard and in this view i add a new item and i name it as pipeline 5 all right and uh, it is easy to you know copy uh, the pipeline so i copy it from pipeline 4 all i need to change is just the jenkins file source all right so in the last video i was using 3 now in this one i need to use 4 so i have saved it now the pipeline is created now let's run it and uh, let us run it from blue ocean view so we have started it now let's see uh, how it looks like so the first stage has started pre build is done build is done then the unit tests and then the deploy now we see these three stages ran in parallel and then released to production so this is how we can execute things in parallel all right it is not like that only on one stage you can uh, do like this but you can do it on various stages i mean whatever level level of um, parallel or sequential you want to create uh, that logic you can create now let us move on to convert this syntax entirely into declarative format so we'll be getting rid of this uh, scripted format and then we'll convert that into declarative so here we have seen that we had steps and uh, we had parallel so all we need to do is first of all this parallel directive of de declarative syntax will not have this round bracket rather it need to be having a uh, curly bracket and before that we need to first remove this steps because that parallel directive won't come inside steps but it would directly come inside the stage so let us remove that and uh, then uh, change this bracket to curly bracket all right now we have a stage and we have added parallel directive inside that next we need to modify these stages which we are having here now for adding stages we have stage directive and declarative syntax and the name of the stage you need to give in brackets all right so here i am giving the name as chrome and then in curly braces i need to add a step here so to add a step i need to use steps directly i cannot mention that uh, bat command directly over there because that is a step so i need to mention that explicitly inside steps 
earlier in scripted ones i was having uh, this steps outside uh, this parallel because all of these were uh, kind of uh, steps uh, for that but in this one these are directive uh, stage and parallel so i need to use steps inside uh, the stage all right so i added this for chrome similarly i do it for firefox similarly i do it for safari and remember that you need not have comma uh, separation between these three stages you save this push this to uh, get and then let us rerun it and see how it works so it works in absolutely same way as it was working earlier so that is the declarative syntax and we'll be using this declarative syntax uh, in this entire course i was just trying to explain to you that how it works in the different syntax so i will see you in the next video if you have any questions feel free to post the questions to me thank you goodbye